Let's watch some crazy stuff, yo! Yo. I can't. It's all right. Hey, wait a minute, Rick. Take your time. I thought this was a commercial. What, what's Stay going on? I mean, Morty, don't focused. don't worry about it. Let's just just see where this goes. Oh my Bro. God! It's still the commercial. Look at it. This is cinema. This is cinema. As y'all see by the title, y'all know what today is. What's going on, YouTube? K Rob here, bringing you the final episode of Life is Strange 2. Thank y'all so much for all the love and support y'all have been showing me on this channel and on this series. I highly appreciate every single one of y'all. We are almost at 1K subscribers. I appreciate every single one of y'all that has gotten me to this point. Without y'all, none of this would be possible. I'm loving the community that we are building here. Also, if you want to stay up to date with the latest updates, I highly recommend you join the Discord. Link will be in the description. Anyways, y'all, without further ado, Let's jump right into the final episode of Life is Strange 2. Once upon a time, oh my goodness, y'all. It's been a journey, y'all. It's been a journey. If y'all been here since episode one, y'all know, bro. This, this episode is going to be fire. All my choices have built up to this moment here. Right here, y'all. Oh my goodness. We made some good choices. We made some bad choices. A lot of y'all in the comment section of my last video, episode four, y'all were like, oh yeah, you you shot Elizabeth? Hey, I do what I gotta do for my broski, you know what I'm saying? Look. And apparently a lot, of, apparently, whoa, English. Apparently a lot of people didn't even shoot Elizabeth. I was like the only one. <laughs> I was the only one, so. I'm kind of excited to see where my ending goes. They learned more about the world. Oh my goodness, bro. I'm excited though. I'm excited. <laughs> a bad accident. Okay, let me chill. Let me calm down. I'm getting a little too separated. You feel me? The big brother had been Bring hurt, it back. And the hunters finally Bring it back. captured him. Okay. We good. They put him in a cage. Yeah, bro. But when he finally escaped, uh, he went to search Ooh. for his little brother. And what did he do? He soon found out that the little wolf had joined a coyote cult. And Ooh, he would not coyote cold. Uh. So, their mother showed up after all that time. I'm not gonna lie. She said, what were you, she What's y'all thoughts on Karen? Him. I feel like Karen is like, the coyote it's cool she helped, she but I don't know. She just wasn't given like was mother. Idol. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. So That's probably me though. Had to kill her. Yeah. I had to, y'all. So y'all were mad at me about that, but look. I had to get it. I had to do it. You feel me? I was kind of in the moment. I was in the moment, y'all. <laughs> I was just mad at Elizabeth. It got kind of personal. You feel me? <laughs> Where do we go now? Like, I know we're heading towards the border, but what's going to happen to Ken? Oh, we're in Arizona. Seven weeks after the events at Haven Point. Oh, okay. So I, I guess we're still with Karen because she's from Arizona. She lived in Arizona, I would say. I've never been to Arizona. I was going to say I want to go, but I just saw that scorpion and I'm kind of changing my mind. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I, just, I just peeped the scorpion. I'm like, oh, I'm good. I wake up with a scorpion in my bed. It's over with. The whole house is getting flipped. I'm turning this into house flipper. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh, the hair we, oh, snap. My hair's back. Yes, and Daniel got his hair back. He don't look like coke in the head no more. Yo, hey. and the bandana. My boy uh, got mushrooms dude, bandana on. We look Why? badass. What time is it? Get up. It's so beautiful. Check it out. Yo. Bro, this reminds me of that one scene from Everything All at Once with our uh when the mom and the daughter were rocks and they were just like admiring everything. And they had like the rocks had googly eyes. I don't know if y'all know what I'm talking about, but this is exactly <laughs> what it reminds me of. So Yeah, okay. Good call. Wow. 
It's amazing. I hope y'all got y'all snacks, bro. It's gonna be a. Uh, this episode gonna be a doozy. Is your eye okay? Yeah. It look kind of cool just, though. Just, it's okay, Nana. I. It's not your fault, promise. dude. Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> this is cinema. You. No matter what happens, you hear me? Yeah. Yeah. I love you too. That's all I need to hear, bro. My world is complete. Go ahead, do it. Yup. Yup. Oh, oh. I'm gonna do it too. It's like I'm there. I'm there, but I'm not there. <laughs> Ah, oh, man. This gonna hurt. I feel it. Something's coming, bro. Something's Demon's coming. Brothers. Something's coming, bro. Always. It's in the chest right now. <laughs> Wait, where's Karen at? Did she dip off again? So, are you still having those bad dreams? You know, about Lisbeth? No, I just... Just... Think about what happened. Is he thinking about how I killed her? Bro, I swear, I swear, Daniel, it was her or us, bro. Much. It was her, it was or, her us. or us. No, no. You saw a dude no pull choice. the gun out on me. I would have been dead. We could have changed your mind. No. You didn't see what I saw. No. Feel bad about it? Not really. I'm going to keep it a stack with you, bro. Nah. Like, no. He didn't see what we I saw, though, y'all. I thought I would. She was on that type of time. Fuck that. Right. Yeah, Daniel, it's, it's over with, bro. Sean. She bad news. Are we criminals now? Um, dang. I, I wouldn't say, I wouldn't say you're a criminal, Daniel. If anyone goes down, it was, it's going to be me, bro. I swear it's going to be me. Nah, I'm, I'm going to say no. I'm just no going to say way. no. I'm gonna say no. Exactly what we had to. Yeah, we had to, bro. We had to. And the whole time, I could call self defense. We'll be judged for what we did. Yeah. That's for sure. I won't let them get us. Hold on. Wait. Oh, damn. Hold on. Well, let's not turn into super villains. <laughs> we're almost at the door. <laughs> let's calm down here. Finally. Big I man. like it here, but we'll have to leave soon. Yeah. That's facts. I know. That's facts. I'm sorry, you know. Sean, I know it's been a long time. Can you tell me the rest of the wolf story? Oh. Aren't you too old, bro? What? Isn't this kid like nine? Oh. Wait, what? Yeah. I can tell you. <sighs> bro, who would say that? We left off. Way too long. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Okay. So. Shoot, I want to hear the story. Mama wolf. The Wolf Brothers barely escaped from the Coyote Cult. She led them to her secret lair, deep in the Red Desert. Mm, bro, that looks good. That looks the beautiful. The Wolf Brothers wow. rested for a while. Cinema. But at some point, they'd have to continue their journey south. They were closer than ever to their father's land, but yeah. between them. And their destination. We got that final stretch, y'all. Mighty fire unicorn. <laughs> but she's nice, so they become friends. Okay, yeah. <laughs> um, excuse me. He just finished the story himself. The story? <laughs> like, you are. but bro, it's my story too. That's true. No, that's right? facts. You're right. No, you're right. You're right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's all you, bro. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's facts. Okay, then. So what happens next? Uh, they they arrive in Mexico. Okay. But the country is rampaged by goblins. Together, the wolves and the unicorn manage to slay them w. and become heroes. That was a better story than what I was going to. Gives them, and all their friends come to Mexico to celebrate. <laughs> oh, we gotta tell yeah. them that Chris is still alive, bro. That's pretty good, and I know. Oh, man, I hope they let us do that. Back to town. Gotta clean up our stuff before we leave. Okay. And this place Dang. is too pretty. I guess it is just us. There's no Karen around. What the heck? Hold on. I have to draw, bro. This? 
I don't know when I'll see this again. So yeah, let's let's just capture the moment. Let's Ooh, capture the moment. Sketching time. You, hey, Daniel, I... you know what time it is, dude. You know what time it is. It's time to put that pen to that paper. Glad you can still draw after. Okay. You know. <laughs> Bro, too, I'm still a pro at this, dog. But even with one eye. I can see it in my mind. I can still sketch anything. Yup. Watch this. You gotta see the shading too, bro. Almost. That's so cool. I don't want you to stop trying. Ever. Uh, <laughs> thanks, man. Honestly. That's so cool. That is actually so cool. You know, he, he's right. Daniel's right. Sean, Sean's powers is the ability that he can draw this well. Like, that's his superpower. Powers, you know what I'm saying, y'all? Powers don't really got to be supernatural, hey, you know? I think everyone has a superpower, superpower in some way. Like striking a pose over the canyon. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I got I you, bro. Try. I got you, dude. I'm going to give you a badass pose, too. Watch this. Hold on. But, yeah, like I was saying, y'all, I feel like each and every one of us has some type of superpower, bro. In some way. Some way, shape, or form, we're good at something. That hurts a little. That looks so I'm crazy, dude. Bed. ta -da. That looks crazy. Finished. Let me check it out. Jeez. Do I really look that evil? He looks more like a super villain. He did look kind of crazy. I'm not going to lie. But the thing is, though, the thing is, though, Daniel, you can look like that, but you can use your powers for good. You don't got to, you know what I'm saying? You can be like a um, like a vigilante. I mean, Batman kind of looked, he looked like a villain, but he cool. You feel me? All right, let's get this stuff packed up. We better get out of here before that heat comes in. Yeah. I hope we can go watch the yeah. stars again. I, and I've heard about that Arizona heat. <laughs> I'm in. This oh, Karen is, cool. is still around. He said mom. Move here. Hey, I can help. Just tell me what you want to put in there. You are the man. Wait, hold on, Daniel. Let's clean help up me out, house. dude. Not if it cleans up by itself. Yo, stop, Daniel. All right, can't dude. Catch it, huh? No shit. He's so lucky. I no, can't do stuff like that, bro. Jeez. He really you abusing his powers. All right, what else can you do? Um, get that soda Yo, for me, Captain Can. Can you take these away? And don't so shake it up funny, to the point where it's just gonna Please blow up in our face, bro. Perfect formation. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Flashlight. Activate flashlight. I could easily go get it myself, but you know, since I do have a brother with superpowers, why not? Thank you. He's gotten so good at his powers, though, y'all. He's gotten so got much the better. Book in the garage. Yeah, I think he did. Why did he never show it to us? Maybe it reminded him of mom too much. Dang. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, he, he right. didn't want to bring up no memories. He trying to he trying to forget that type of stuff. Well, I think we got everything packed. Let's hit the trail, cowboy. Yeah. Let's get it. What's that noise? What am I hearing in my ear? Is that? Oh, I'm like. What are you doing? What the heck? Yo, bro, if you don't leave the what scorpion the fuck, alone, dude, don't do that. What's wrong? Just Stop leave the, just leave the scorpion alone, it, dude. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, dude. Sorry, little guy. Chill. Do my eagles. Do eagles eat scorpions? No idea. <laughs> cool. Let's go. He he kind of slipped up. Y'all see that? He was he was he was about to slip up right there. I wish we saw more falling stars, or any. <laughs> bro, this. Looks crazy. Hey, we saw the Milky Way, dude. How cool is that? Yeah, that's true. And Mars. That was so cool. Bro. Arthur and Stanley let us use the telescope. No light pollution. Yeah. I know the stars look crazy here These at night. These guys are real cool. Does it ever rain in the desert? Well, oh. You kind of standing uh, close to that edge, aren't you? Good question. Oh, you tweet. <laughs> Is he good, bro? Yo, hey, <laughs> what they do to my man's at Haven Point? So like he's tweaking out. Sculpture when we get back. Hell yeah, you're like the magic assistant. It's nice to be able to use my power out here, not yeah hide it. Yeah, true. And I mean, yeah, you're using your powers for good though. They're all cool with it. Mom doesn't say much about my power. Why do you think? 
Bro, do y'all think Karen got powers? Oh no, I can't even, I can't say nothing. She sounds she's, she's confused. Um, confused. Like, what do you mean? Are you good? Can you get down? She's my mom. Okay, cool. Well, you know. I mean, she hasn't seen you for years. Not sure she can. I mean, deal with all of this at the same time. I'd be surprised too if my son just came out with powers and I didn't know about him. Like, hey, looks like a job for our local super psychic boy. Give me right, give me right, Daniel. Come on. You've lifted up heavier things. I saw you lift the whole so, redwood tree stone. Maybe you, you can got help this. Us get out of here. Mm, I'll try. Step back. Yo, be try. I know you're gonna like. I know, I know you could do it though. Come on now, that's like too easy. That's cake for you, bro. That's cake for you. You didn't even sweat on that. I hope it's okay. <laughs> nice man. You talking about hope it's okay? <laughs> that man, yo, that boy Daniel know he badass. Like <laughs> he know he's him. Life is strange two, episode five. Here we go. Here we go. This is it, y'all. The final stretch. Let's get it. This where we live? Hey, I'm gonna go see what Joanne is doing. <laughs> go for it. Joanne? I have to bring back the telescope to Stanley and Arthur. Oh, this is like another like little town, like a little village type of thing. Went to town for weekly supplies. Some pancakes left in the kitchen? <laughs> Back soon. Okay, we kind of chilling out here. Daniel, you copy? Yes, I read you. Ten four. I have a oh, pancake we got the alert in the talking. kitchen. Repeat, pancake alert. Oh man, sorry. I was gonna eat with Joanne. Oh, my, hey, my oh, fault. Man, hey, you, you can't, you can't chill with your old man. My fault. You right. Crops. You see. Excuse me, water boy. Did oh, you, you remember gotta get to them feed crops? The I never forget. Ask mom. Hey man, these kind of looking dead. I can grow stuff like she can. Mm, maybe in Mexico. Oh yeah, we can grow a lot of stuff there. Ah. <laughs> uh, Ah, uh, ah, uh, you know what I'm saying? Water tank. Dude, we could put red food coloring in the water and turn this into a blood tank. Dude, yeah. that I red 40? I don't know, bro. I heard red 40 causes cancer. I'm just going to let you know that right now. Beaver Creek sign? Yo. Hey, do you miss Beaver Creek? I miss having a house. Tell them about Chris. Uh, Dead. But I really miss Chris and Grandma and Grandpa. You gotta let him know though. Just glad we're still a family out there. Dang, you didn't even. He not going to. Is he ever gonna tell him? Oh, climb. Oh, wait, you could climb on top of this. Hold on. What's up here? Oh, okay. Sit and draw? You know it, bro. Come on now. Every time I get a chance to, I'm doing it. Let's go. Oh, this looks crazy. Got a good picture of it. I'm ready to draw now. With one, like with one eye, that just, that is something else, dude. Okay, just draw it. Like what? Bro, it's like a, bro, it's literally like photo memory, bro. This dude had, draw wolf pack, draw biomechanical fantasy. I'm gonna draw Wolfpack. It it just sounds like on brand, you know. Got a good picture of it. I like that he's using really his imagination drawing. a little bit more in these drawings too. I'm messing with that. Yeah, that's fire. I pay for that. 
Like, for real. i definitely pay for that. Put it on my wall or something. Now I can though. see why Karen likes it out here. That looks good. It just took a while. It's like, it's peaceful. She and you, really doesn't want to be a part of society. Yeah, like, you don't have to worry about Except too much. Just this tiny one. Seems manageable, too. Hey, no cops. That's a W. All right, let me see what's inside here, though. We got note, poem, picture. Who is this? Karen looks so young and fragile on this Dang. picture. Dang. Hmm. Maggie and Karen. Hard times. Oh. Group picture? Looks like they all finally found their home. Oh, this is everybody that lives here. Okay. Wait, this is Karen's bed and she gave us... Oh, she gave us the bed bed. That's a W though. You know, that's a W moms. I can't really... I can't get too mad at her about that. Take USB key? Wait, what? What is this for? Oh, she'll be writing poems. That's one thing about Karen. She's she really get at writing them poems. We writing her own life. Facts. Let me see this. I am a solo Mobius strip. Just when I reach the end, I go back to the beginning. Resign myself to new faces. The privilege to escape and rewrite another draft. Goddess laughs at plans, then shows me the page left unmarked for years. Out in the ghost desert, the seeds return as saplings to reveal their age and power. Now I go back forward, layered with fear and hope to water the children of the sun. Okay. Don't believe I would find a soul within or without a church. A miracle was sleep and food and fuck. A day without shit until it was not. Now we run to celestial spires, oh, visions of the fake prophet, engulfed in ego and belief as the burning cross falls on all your cruel angels. I am the bonfire of vanities, so when the dam breaks, we all flood, like glass on a mirage, if I believe. Wait, that was kind of, that was kind of poetic. I'm not going to lie, that, that kind of hit a little bit. Letter? Wow. I hope Karen sends this to Clarence too. Dang, she wrote a whole essay. Wait a minute. Hi, Mom and Dad. I've been thinking about this letter for a while, and I know it's been a long, long time coming. So I'm sitting here tonight thinking about the words I should have written 10 years ago. You always used to say, everything happens for a reason. We fought about it then. Oh, oh so like, okay, she crossed out those stuff. Okay, okay. I understand why now. There is a reason I feel like I have to reach out to you both tonight from the desert. I know you've only heard from me once by phone and six times by letter for almost a decade. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you and I was certainly not trying to punish you like you told me. Don't laugh, but I just didn't know what to say or write. Poets block. Just like how you had to block me from your life after I left Esteban. I understand that was how you had to deal with a problem child. An only child who didn't live up to your expectations. There's no denying that I failed you, but the burden weight of your aspirations as parents failed me too. You had such a rigid opinion of what I was supposed to be that I just didn't have the chance, opportunity, to explore who I actually was. You wanted a daughter to grow up happy, find a good job, and great husband, settle down, to breed. Have kids and raise them in faith to continue the cycle of suburbia. That daughter wasn't me. I know that you were raised in a different time and culture, so I didn't understand your point of view. Like you didn't understand your wayward daughter. Maybe a bridge too far for us at the time. After Danny was born, you knew I wanted to take a break. Some time to figure things out in my head and heart. It didn't make sense to you or dad, and I get that, but I was so desperate and only Esteban was willing to give me that time because he saw how unhappy I was. I don't blame you for the decision to leave and maybe a time out would have led to the same outcome. We will never know and I try not to live in regret. My life has been a roller coaster, and there have been times I long to hear your voices and thoughts. And I know when I last talked to you in New York to ask for help in paying back my debts, you wanted to help. But it was on your condition to return right back to where I couldn't return. I hate that was our last conversation. I am sorry I reached out to you this day. I am sorry I broke your hearts. I am sorry I let you broke mine for silencing me for so long. I think we've paid our dues. And now I sit under a blue field of crystal stars like the poet I hope I am, writing and waiting for a chance to rebuild an old bridge with my mother and father. I hope we can cross it one more time. Your daughter, and she crossed out the love. This was deep. You know I gotta get the pancakes. Come on now, I gotta eat the pancakes. One thing Claire and Karen have yeah. coming. Their love for pancakes. Gotta eat the pancakes. I love pancakes. Yo, pancakes or waffles, y'all. Be honest, for real. Be, be honest. Pancakes or waffles. I'm more of a pancake type of dude. I'm just gonna say that right now. Now, I didn't forget that I got that USB. Let me see what this USB is about. I totally forgot about that key. Whoa. I should have gone through that flash drive weeks what ago. The heck? Hey, Dad. Yo. 
Aww. Lila always. Lila. Yo, W memories. What? Sean's tabs. Brody's so good at describing painful situations. Brody. Oh, snap. You can go home again by Brody Holloway. The last time I saw my mother before this year, I was telling her to leave me the fuck alone. That I was done with the whole bullshit family. My real fam were the strangers I met on the road, who became friends, not my family, who became strangers. I adopted all the online connections I made around the world and all those wandering souls that I would encounter on my journeys ahead. You would be reading about them right now, except the next time I saw my mother, she was in hospice care at our Utah home. Her body light and frail as a web holding my hand and telling me that she was sorry about everything that kept us apart for most of my adult life. My mom was dying of cancer and she was sorry. So I cried, she cried, my brother cried, we all cried. And all of the years of family bullshit blew away to dust, like that, finger snap sound. I just wasn't mad anymore. I didn't know it would be so easy or so hard. It didn't mean the past didn't happen or that I wasn't responsible in my own way. My brother used to tell me I was a fake liberal because while I was out trying to save the world, he had to take care of mom and the family estate. Maybe he was right, but I told him that he also had the money to take care of them. God damn, if I was in charge of the finances, I would have given away the family estate and we'd be broke, living in co-op. My brother knows this. Families are just fucking weird. Society tells us to love your parents and siblings simply out of blood and chance, but what if you hate each other? What if you're only linked by random DNA? What if? That's true, bro. That is, I, hey, oh, he got some more, hold on. Whatever, it doesn't matter. I've seen the best and worst of people everywhere I roll. You tend to have those extremes at 3 a.m. at an empty gas station or on some desolate freeway. Yes, I've seen strong families bond in hard times. I know there are big siblings out there who will always care for their little siblings and vice versa. They helped me to understand our fragile filial ecosystem. In her last hours, my brother and I held my mom's thin fingers as she passed on to a place, I hope, is better than the one she came from. After she was gone, I found a stash of some old school essays and stories, the only thing I was good at in school. I never knew she kept this stuff or that she cared, even if we never understood each other. She must have been a little proud that I went my own way and tried to be a force for good. Mothers know how to make you cry like a little bitch. The first time tears had burned my eyes in a long time. It felt good. So now, I've come back to a home I once vowed to never return. I don't feel so alienated this time, even if I still am. Like I say too often, there's a difference between being alone and being lonely. Now I have an estate to deal with and more responsibility than I actually want. But I have to see this as karma, or destiny, or the dharma of the privileged. Don't panic, but I may be taking a break from my life on wheels, just to see who or what I can help. Now I have more resources to spread around. I'm sure my brother will approve, insert sarcasm, if we're still talking after all this memorial bonding. Okay, it's not a happy ending, but maybe it's a hopeful one. And speaking of hope, given the sad state of this sad nation, I've been thinking it's time to move outside my comfort zone, send dispatches from places and people I'm not so familiar with, places I can explore to tell new stories from, like Canada or Mexico, or the road never ends. Yeah, I ghosted her. Dang. But so glad to see Lila's back. That's crazy though. Like I couldn't bring her in. I did ghost her. Yeah, I did, y'all. I did ghost her. I'm not gonna lie. But it was for a good purpose. I did not want to bring her into any of this that's going on with me personally. I hope nobody's mad I've been out of touch. Brain needed a timeout. Yes, it can happen to me too. People are such pussies about mental health. Just talk and take care of each other for fuck's sake. Bro, I hope she understands, y'all. I really do. Karen's tab. I want to see what Karen's tab's talking about. I had no clue there was a network of seed pirates. What the heck? Karen's a real life hacker. Dude. <laughs> oh, she's all about that agriculture. I feel you. Karen takes on oh. some small peace works for a living. <sighs> Must pay better than poetry. So she's like the neighborhood therapist? What is this? Hi, Karen. Thanks for your last advice column. We got quite a response and a lot of hits. I know you don't want a social media footprint, but you could generate a lot of clicks with your insights. Looking forward to your next piece. Please make sure to send your invoice. Okay. Dang. All right, Karen. She getting busy. All right, y'all. Let's go give back that telescope and find Daniel. David's trailer? Who is David? Hold on. Y'all, I definitely found an Easter egg, bro. I was just looking around this entire spot, and I look inside this window, and I, that's David Matt's. Hold on, Sean. Hold on. Oh, that's what's cool, Hold man. on, dude. You, yo, okay. That is David Madsen. 
with Chloe and the mama, Joyce. So this is David's spot? Bro, that's crazy. David is here, y'all. What? Yo, wherever we go, we got Captain Spirit near us. Let's go. W. Daniel, that's a good drawing too, hey, bro. Your Captain Spirit drawing. Fire. What's awesome. Thanks. That was hard, dude. Wish I could show it to Chris. Do you think he can visit us down in Puerto Lobos? Okay, so, um, I mean, why not? Yeah, shoot, I mean... Let's make it happen. Let's do that. Yeah. Instead of snowmen, we can make sandcastles. <laughs> he funny for that. Morning, Sean. Morning, guys. Stanley and Arthur. What's good? I got something for y'all. Here you go. Hey, what's up? Morning, Sean. Join us. Have a seat. Hey, just in time for our special desert brew. Oh. And dust free. Thanks. Love the dust free coffee. So much. Sean, it's too early to be so awake. No kidding. Hey, how was your sleep over in the canyon? Fire. <laughs> Amazing. We watched the sunrise. Daniel loved it too. That's my favorite view out here. It's like ancient times, but it never gets old. Unlike us, darling. <laughs> they funny for that. will be here long after we're gone. Hope you looked up. We did. Thanks for hooking us up. Shout out to y'all for the microscope. Anytime. Saw the Milky Way and all Becky that. Becky loves to stargaze when she visits us. That's the only way to get Arthur to camp now. Becky is the real astronomer in the family. Wonder where she got this. <laughs> From her mom, probably. Hope you guys get to meet Becky. Uh, she visits a lot. Does she come she... visiting? We often? might be able to. Not as much as I'd want. Can't really blame her. But you know, well, some parts of the year this place is full of friends and family. Christmas, for example. Why come here? And never get bored. So, don't you ever get bored? Being out here is a big change. We right, do. it don't look like too much to do out here. We're in a desert. I miss the parks, cafes, shopping, but this place is something else. And we feel safe out here. If you could have seen me as a family that. man a few years ago, I had everything. This does look like a safe nothing. spot. Now I have nothing. Not too much going on. Quiet but spot. Everything. Thanks to this one. <sighs> After we got together, we both had serious breakdowns. Then we got the hell out of the Bay Area. Mm, the there you go. I hear that. I'm just so fucking tired of running. I hope me and Daniel find our own way. You will. People come here to reset their life, become the person they want to be or used to be. You're smart. You'll figure out your next direction. Appreciate right, that, Gramps. Speak for yourself, Grandpa. <laughs> My body might be 59. But I'm 25. Okay. <laughs> hey. Uh -huh. Okay. I'll remember that on the next hike. <laughs> I'm going to see what Daniel said. W to. couple. W couple. Thanks for the desert, bro. Shout out to y'all, bro. Appreciate y'all. Hey, Sean. What were you doing at Arthur and Stanley's place? You're a little too young to be stalking me, dude. Dang. How did he know I was over there? Where'd he at? You know what? I saw them kissing the other day. Ah. Uh... <laughs> I mean, not really. It's kind of normal, you know, dude. Like, normal for people. Right, to for kiss. people to right when they right. love each other, they gonna kiss, bro. I, know. I just mean they're really cute together. I <laughs> somebody who cares about me like that when I get old. Ah. Uh, Come by Joanne's place. We're making wild sculptures. All right, for sure. I'll be Hold there. I'll up. be there. Give me a second. I'll be over in a minute. Hey, okay. I'm messing with the flags. Happy Pride yeah, Month to my people out there. Much. Yeah. Wait, hold on. Where are y'all at? What the heck? Do you feel oh. What's up, Joanne? See for yourself. Man, check this out. Okay, Daniel. He going it. crazy. Got it. You over here training. All right, Joanne. Who are you? That child is... Something else. Something special. Yeah. Yeah. He's something else for sure. One a lot. Don't worry. Yup. Mm, yeah, I bet. <laughs> but you have your own talent, Sean. I'm dead serious. 
That's what I said. Um, just, just doodles. I don't know. It's just doodles and shit. He's got that eye. I no my pun. You feel me? Like shit too. He's Compared really good. To all the dope stuff that was being done. But every artist is fucking unique, Sean. Yeah. We all got something to bring to the world. Yo. Always an artist? Did you always want to be an artist? <laughs> good grief, no. I tried very hard not to be one. Dang. Till I realized it was useless. Listen, if you want to be an artist, you will be. It's not always easy. That's what I said, bro. If we end, get out of this alive. It's pretty fucking cool. Go become an Speaking artist, dude. Of, do you mind giving me a hand here? Oh, uh, I don't know if I can. Yes, you can. I just need your input. Okay? Okay. Yeah, for sure. What's up? Okay. Let me know. Sure. <laughs> Why not? Ah, uh, there you go. Now, go stand over there. Daniel? You ready to start again? Wait, whoa, whoa. Oh, what yes. are we about to do? Hold on. Hold up. What's going on? He about so, to... for my next trick, I'd love to see if you can connect these three pieces. Huh? I've made a model of what I have in mind here, but go ahead and be the artist. Okay. And we don't need a crane to lift this stuff. <laughs> Daniel can snap these together like block toys. Hell yeah. Let's do this. Wait, what is this? Metal arm, metal head. Okay, metal belly. So I gotta like put this together basically. Let me see. Add. Now, let's throw on that spider. Oh, I gotta put on. Okay, okay. I gotta put this. All right. Bad, 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 bad. Let me take this off. I gotta take this off. I think the belly goes first. Okay, yeah. Put the metal belly okay, on, Daniel. right? Put the Can metal belly on, then we're gonna put the arms slam on. Slam dunk the earth ball onto the base. What? Yeah. This layup. Uh, you should totally do like the model, but with the spider on top. That's true, that's true. Let me see. Hold on, what happens if I turn it right, hey, though? Can you... Turn that earth ball around a little bit. Check it out. Okay. Now add the metal Summon arm. The spider queen. Watch this. Be careful. I don't know Daniel. if this matters, y'all. <laughs> I don't know, bro. I was gonna put put something crazy. Hold on. Put this up there. Okay. Boom. Mm. And then put the metal head on there. Mm. We now, chilling. Let's move Mr. Pancake's head Mr. onto Pancake's the pedestal. Head. I like it. I like it. Yeah. I like that. I like that. That looks good right there, right there. That looks good right there, don't it? Or does it have to look exactly like this? It's got to look like this, y'all. Oh, you know what then? Okay, let's move let's, let's move the arms around. Is this how it is? I don't think so. Wait. That's as close as it's going to get. I'm not going to lie to you, Joanne. Um, it looks cool, bro. It kind of looks remind me of the Statue of Liberty a little bit. I I don't yeah. Let's finish that up. There you go, Joanne. How you feeling about that? That's that's for my artistic eye. I feel like we're almost done. Well, I think this is it. Looks good to me. Only if the muse approves. What Not you think? what I had in mind, but it's still cool. Okay, cool. You cool, did cool, a great cool. job. In it. I tried. Well, Sean, Daniel, I think art might be in your family DNA. There's no escape. Dang. I think we're done for the day. That's Thank his superpower, so y'all. Okay. That statue kind of look tough up close. <laughs> Hold on, it look cool. Joanne, cool peoples. I mess I with it. I bet you would like Minecraft. It, it, it's kind of like facts. Yeah, I've read about it. It's a video game, right? <laughs> yes. And you can build whatever you want. In <laughs> hey, dog. Yeah, the Minecraft. <laughs> All right, where's Karen at? She been gone for a minute, y'all. Bro, <laughs> if they remember my super name. Cool for you to find. Or you accept this quest to find my secret treasure. Come on, you know I'm ready. Let's do it. Ten four. Let's do it. Okay, you're I'm on, ready. Nano. 
If I can find you in a forest, I can find anything. Facts. Great, Sean. Listen carefully. You will find the two items that will reveal where the treasure is. Okay. Deal. So for the first item is near the place with many wings that cannot fly. Many wings that cannot fly? That's, that's it. That's... Okay, that's... Cool. You can do it, big brother. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I hope. And don't bother checking mom's trailer. It's outside. Okay, it's outside. Okay, cool. Let me see. Ah, oh, look, he watching me too. Look at him up there. Warm. Warm, okay. They're warming up. Warming up, okay. Talk to me, talk to me now. Warm. Okay. Uh, it's oh, wait, 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 wait. Dude, you're a snowman. You said I'm warm and now I'm a snowman. Which one is it, dude? Is it this? Oh, man. Oh, I found it. There we go. He said there's two clues. Okay. That's the first one. Ahoy, matey. I found a map of a way. Yeah. Don't lose it because you'll need it to match up with the other part. Got you, got you, got, <laughs> got you. Got it. Playing a little scavenger hunt. Item. You'll need to find something that eats the sun. Something uh -huh. that eats the sun. Sure. What eats the sun? Talk to me. Talk to me, Daniel. Hold on. Talk to me. I'm going a little too far. Let me see. Cars. You're lost, Sean. Come on, dude. Like, am I warm or what? Talk getting to me. Close, okay, getting closer. It's got to be like around here in, in this area. Wait. I think the solar panels. Here we go. Oh my goodness, that's that was a good one. That was a good one. I didn't think about that. I didn't think about the solar panels. I didn't even know we had solar panels here. <laughs> oh, that's where the treasure is. That looks like that looks like the little junkyard with the cars. I know where that's Found at. Found it. Nice. And it's a. Yeah, I know where that's at. Tracing paper sheet with a red cross. Yeah. Now just match up the other paper. Then the treasure is yours, Captain. Okay. Oh, holy, I think I have the whole treasure map. Oh, no. I think, yeah, I think the treasure's gonna be over here. That's a cool ass map you drew, Cars. dude. Cars. Yeah, 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 I found it right here. There we go. What is this? Ooh, looks like something's buried here. Yes. Is that an earring? I think I have found the hidden treasure. <laughs> yeah. I knew you could do it. I found this under an old trailer. <laughs> Looks like gold, right? Um, I'm not a prospector, but it looks like the real deal. Store! <laughs> you know what time it is. Yo. Victory, Victory dance time? Oh, he hidden it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta hit. Come on, hit some. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, boy, yeah. Hey, they hitting it. I was messing with that. I'm messing with it. I like that. W, w bonding session for real. That was cool. That was cool. Oh, I think you're spotting mom's truck coming back. Oh, she coming? Mm, yes, 100% her. Gotcha. I don't see her work. Right with the groceries. Where are we looking? There she is. Mama! Mama! Mama's back with the groceries. Oh, snap. What, what grocery store she go to? I know there ain't no Whole Foods or nothing out here. Come on now. Mama! Oh, shit. Damn. Hello? I'm right here. Wait. Going to Wait a small minute. Town for supplies. Always... Hey, is up? that who I think it is? Good morning. <laughs> Howdy, Sean. That's David! That was a town trip. <laughs> Hate these trips. Uh, people look at us as if we're aliens. Wait! The sand people. <laughs> the deserters have David Madsen! Offerings from Das Kapital. Jolie! Oh my goodness! <laughs> I missed you. Next time. I ain't expect, bro. Wait. <laughs> he got a little ponytail <laughs> going now. 
<laughs> Looking good. What's your secret? Defying death on a daily basis. He don't look all high and mighty anymore, bro. He kind of look like he oh, mellowed right. out. I'm, I'm messing with the, the new look, David. Hey. Hold on. Thanks, Angel. Here. That's crazy. That's a blast uh, from the past man, right Karen. there. Catch you later. Take care. What? Hey, so how did you guys like your night in the canyon? Oh, oh, it was amazing. It was, it was very, it was very amazing. amazing. It was very amazing. So many stars. So quiet. Good call, Karen. I knew you'd like it. Stargazer. Glad you got to see that. Hi, Mom. Mama! How was the town? Mama! Town life always sucks. <laughs> but we got something for you. Think fast. Whoa! Yes! Thanks, David. <laughs> Yo, that's catch, crazy, bro. Totally. David is in the mix again? Wow, but I'm dude. Way better now. Wow, dude. Wow, dude. Wow, dude. No that's matter crazy, what he's bro. been through. He just wants to be a kid and That's play. That's so crazy. <laughs> yep. Daniel hasn't been like this in forever. Is he going to bring up Chloe? On him. About time you boys went camping. Hope Daniel didn't oh. get scared by all the critters. Yeah, not anymore. He's seen a lot worse. Even though I like, I don't, even, I don't really like David, but. He can defend himself. You're right. Hey, hey when David's like cool, he's cool. Off. You feel me? Maybe too much. <laughs> That's you just crazy to see him for a month. And I still can't get over Daniel's <sighs> skills. Me neither. <laughs> Me neither. But I never figured it out, so I don't try anymore. Well, take it from an old soldier. Wow, that's but actually him. You trained him well. I appreciate He's a good kid. <laughs> David nice. giving me my flowers? I tried my best. What? I guess it's reassuring. But what do I know? Never met someone with a superpower before. Ah, not always easy. Ah, he listens to me. I don't know if I did right. Come on Does now, really know. You must not Listen, know about it. Come on, dude. Losing a kid is the toughest job. You had one right under your nose. Trust me. Shout out to Come Max. That was easier. <laughs> You're married. Oh. You didn't tell me you were married. Nah, he used to be. Us, we're divorced now. Her daughter's death left her heart broken. Wow! For me. We just Yo. couldn't put our pieces back together after what happened. I'm sorry, David. And yeah, the worst thing is, I never had the chance to do the right thing for my stepdaughter. Wow. Before she died. Wow! Like oil and water. And she was always starting shit. Guess that's hard for a kid to get a new father. Especially one like me. I just had no clue how to deal with her. Yo. Wish I did. The anyway, Chloe cameo. You can't go back. It's hard. Nope. Thanks for talking, David. Better start my delivery now. That's so cool, dude. That's so cool. Nah, I like that. snacks in town. Arthur's gonna freak. <laughs> Dang, so this is what David's doing now? Catch you later, Sean. Wow. He actually mellowed out. I'm okay. actually messing with David, bro. Time out. Like, oh my God. he's melt. cooler. That was awesome, Mom. Now I know why they don't play baseball in the desert. You throw way better than Sean. Dang, yeah. W Mom. <laughs> We're not done out here yet. Let's get this food inside before it melts. For no sure, problem. for sure. Dang, she got some good groceries, too. I saw that. Dang, they, they filled them bags up. We got enough groceries for a month. She is so cool. You think? <laughs> Joanne is so cool. Stanley's so cool. Wait, hold on. The heat is so cool. <laughs> You're way too easy, bro. Dude, Can't help he's showing off, man. <laughs> hey, look. Just be you. You might as well get these two bags in my say, hand, bro. <laughs> don't get too cozy here. This is a rest stop. I know. Okay, let the let, let the bag go in first, I guess. Okay. Jeez. Pardon me. What's going on out here? Mama! Ah, it's like sharing a brewski with my mama. Look. I have to oh, admit, nah. I do miss that Pacific Northwest weather sometimes. Yeah, I bet. You've been here over a month now. What do you think of our little oasis? I mean, it's cool. Like, you feel me? Like everybody's cool. Everybody's cool here. Cool. Yeah. Different. Can't it's cool. Even believe it's been chill. Out about Daniel's power. 
Well, Sean, oh, it's still hard for me to wrap my head around it. But people here are not going to get in your space. They have their own past, too. That's why people come here from all over the country mm. for their own reasons. Not perfect, but it works. It's W. So peaceful here. It is so peaceful out here. <laughs> Guess that's what everybody's really looking for. Peace. Peace. Yeah. You're probably Facts. right. Yes. I still feel like we're really privileged out here. There's bad shit going on in this desert. <laughs> yeah. I don't think you can ever really get away from everything. You can't escape reality. Even here. We just live slightly apart from it. Um, how'd you find this place? So... How did you end up here? <laughs> this place is not on the map. Like most of us, I was first brought here by someone. Maggie. After Maggie? I failed to make it in New York, oh, that's her I homie. was lucky enough to meet her down in Florida. She's had a tough life. This place was her getaway. She's long gone now, but her name is still written all over this place. Mm. Well, thanks for bringing us here. Oh, Sean. I'm glad I was able to help you. Facts. By the way, can you grab your brother so we can all talk? Is everything... We good? Okay. It's always something, bro. I just thought we could spend this day together. Just oh, okay, okay. Us. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. As long as you're not on, like, no type of weird activities, then I'm cool with that. Let's have... Hey, yeah, bring Daniel. Super Wolf. Bring Daniel here. We need you at Karen's trailer. Copy? <laughs> Ten four. <laughs> Hola. Hola. Is she gonna leave us, y'all? I just got a bad feeling. I don't know. How about a trek around the canyon today? You in? Totally. Oh, that sounds cool. Let's pack then. That sounds fire. Hey, let's do that. Just the three of us? We chilling. You'll need a good night's sleep after all this. And the car's just half a mile down the path. This place makes for a pretty cool bedroom, though. Man. I'm beat. Oh, sorry. Just got one last thing to show you guys. I can't get enough of this place. <laughs> bro, this looks so good, bro. Come on, Daniel. Give me your hand. <sighs> <sighs> Yo, she about to show us the stars or something? Slow down, Mom. You walk too fast. More walk, less talk. My fault, you right. Daniel pass me up. <laughs> Guys, check this out. Let me see. Now, Yo. This is art. Yo. It's so big. This is crazy. And so quiet. Oh. Except for the birds of prey. Shh. Listen. Stubby moment. If we're lucky. Yeah. And we got mushroom with us too. Ow. Oh, 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 I gotta do it. Oh, 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 oh. I gotta do it too. Come on. Uh oh. Let's do it. I hear What's a up? wolf. Better be careful of hunters out here. The wolf brothers. Come on, we the wolf brothers. You right. help us. Come on, Mama Wolf. You must hide all the time, Mom. There's not a lot to do, but it's enough for me. Good thing Joanne likes to come with me. Oh. I bet she would be fun to go hiking with. Well, not when I go too fast. Dang. She's all about the journey. We usually find a good pace. Um, oh, snap. Oh, why'd the, why the camera Joanne just flip me like Sean. that? They make art, so they stop to look at stuff. You're way more like me. Fast. <laughs> yeah, I am like you, Daniel. So let's hurry up. This looks phenomenal, dude. Like, the colors is just satisfying. No light pollution, so we can see the stars. Yeah, this is beautiful. <sighs> I love this to come is beautiful, here to get away man. from <laughs> away. This yeah, nah. This is like the perfect spot just to get away from everything, I clear bet. your mind. It's the best Shoot, spot. I bet. <laughs> Let's sit down. It's a W moment. So, hey. I do appreciate that you guys stuck around this long. Facts. Thank you. 
um, got to know you better. It was good to get to know you better. See your life. This place is pretty cool. It's like Fairy Road, but nicer. I got to learn about living in a desert, hiking canyons, counting stars. Fury Road. Natural born explorer. Is that Mad Max? It's hard to believe you two are actually out here with me. I was I don't lucky. Know. We had that sounds like chance. a Mad Max reference. I could be wrong though. Just know I love both of you so much. I know you had it rough lately, but it'll be better when you're settled. Um, I mean, you could come with us. You feel me? <clears throat> By the way, uh, if you she's not gonna to, do it though, it's worth a try. Come with us. But she's not gonna want to. To Mexico. That would be cool. I would love to come see you settled into a new home. You're almost there. Dang. But I have to be upfront with both of you. What happened? She still don't want to be a mom. Is catching up on us. Huh? What do you mean? When we were in town, uh, we saw some stories in the papers. The feds are definitely tracking us down in the region. Shit. And they'll find us. Yeah, we're cooked. I ain't gonna lie. I think we're cooked here, y'all. I think y'all were right about me wow. shooting Elizabeth, but I gotta let this play out, Figures. though. I'm not, I'm not taking back any decision I made. Nice I'm not taking back any decision. I'm going in. I'm, so I'm, I'm gonna go out. I'm gonna go out like a real one. Don't worry. This is it? See you, Nana. We'll leave tomorrow. Dang. We gotta keep going. We stay running, bruh. I'm tired of running. Like, In dude. That back, Sean. I'm so sick of running, bro. We just can't have no peace. We, we definitely criminals. I'm not gonna lie, but dang. That's why I brought you back here. Leave us alone. I made these for the 4th of July, but this is better. Oh! I love those things. Wait, what is this? What is that? Whoa, oh, are those those awesome. uh, those lanterns, those light lanterns? Those are cool. Let's light up the sky. I've never done that before, but I've seen them in like TV shows and stuff. That is dope. Especially when you got like a whole bunch of them. Yeah, man, that looks fire. That's fire though. Yeah, yeah, I mess with that. I mess with that. Uh, it's gonna reach dad. It's gonna reach dad. Look at that. Nah, he. Nah, Daniel. Daniel too fire for that. Nah, he cold. He cold. He giving us a light show for real. What? He a good kid, y'all. I think we did we did it. We did all right. We did all right with Daniel, you know. Up until now, I give ourselves a pat on the back for Daniel. I give ourselves a pat on the back because he didn't turn into no menace. There was some points I thought I messed up, but I feel like we did all right. Dude, that's cinema, dude. That is cinema. All right. This is it. Gotta get moving. Gotta hit the road. Everybody here was cool. Bro, even David was cool. Like, and and you know, we go way back with David. He's cool now. Police? Oh, they talking about that fire in that newspaper. Oh, snap. Um, are you guys all set up to leave? No. <laughs> so that's we have to leave again. I think... I'm kind of scared. Oh. Dang. Oh, honey. Um... How far is the border? How far is the border? Not that far. Uh, maybe a five or six hours drive. 
It won't be easy crossing that border. So I'm going to give you a head start on the police. Wait, how? Wait, what? What's your plan? The cops are after me, too, for what happened in Nevada. So they can catch me instead of you. Fair trade. Mom. What? We'll go to jail for helping us. It's not about me right now. We need to get your asses to Puerto Lobos. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank so you. much. Thank you, Karen. I knew what I was doing. I got no when beef, I came Karen. To Haven Point Karen, looking for your brother. I you felt good. You good in my it eyes. was the right thing to do. And I feel the same today. You have to stay true to yourselves. Mmm. But it's hard. Spit that monster. Spit that game. Yeah. Something gets in the way. It can get ugly. You have to find some sort of balance. Dad didn't raise us this way. We'll do whatever it takes. Fuck the rules. Yeah. We'll do whatever we can to survive. Yes. We already did. Yes. You did what you had to, to protect your brother all the way from Seattle to Arizona. Facts. And I'm sorry. You had to make hard decisions to stay safe. But sometimes, you just have no other choice. She said it, bro. Okay. She this said it. Last roundup. If I didn't kill Wait, Elizabeth, I feel like she would have been chasing us, bro. All right. I'm gonna go do one last checkup on the truck before you hit it. And don't Dang. forget what we talked about. It's your life. Sean, uh, you should go see David. He has something for you. David, okay. I got you. Nah, we definitely gotta see David before we leave for sure. Hundred percent. Dang! Wait a minute. Dang, Karen gave us a hundred thirty dollars. All right, cool. Hold on. Yeah, Karen, you cool in my book? Right to Karen? Yeah, go ahead. Let me see. What, what, what can we say? I'm gonna call her mom this time. I'm not gonna say Karen. I'm not gonna hey, say mom. Karen. I know you're better with words than me, but still, here it goes. Oh, I think I finally. Thanks for Daniel. I'm doing thanks for Daniel. It was so good for Daniel to see you again. He needed that more than anything. Facts. Don't give up on your freedom. Sorry for getting you into trouble. Uh, sorry. Mm. I'm gonna say don't give up on your freedom. Please don't give up on your freedom. Okay? It's the best thing you've taught us. Mmm. We'll reach you once we find our own freedom. Thank you so much. Love. That's a good letter. I'm, I'm messing with that. That might that might bring a tear to her eye. I like that. Yeah, I'm messing with that. Not too long. Not too short. Like, it's it's, it's, it's the right. It's the right. You feel me? It's the right letter. Leave that says, yeah, let's leave that, leave that. Oh, snap, wait, hold on. I was tidying up. There's a box in here? Huh. Is that the same person who rode her back in Beaver Creek? Wait. Hi, Rumi. Yes, I know New York in August is hot as balls. You did say you like the heat, but my apartment under the roof can be really suffocating. Don't want to rub it in, but Aspen is my new summer home. Daily temp around 70 degrees and hot tub at night. Anthony's cabin is more like a ski lodge. Next trip, maybe you can tag along. Poets retreat. Best cure for your writer's block. And please let me know when you can pay me back for August's rent. I definitely need it for next month and up here in Aspen. I'll see you on September 5th instead of the 4th, so put your clothes on. Stay out of trouble and remember to water my babies this time. She was that close. 
Wait, what? Sucks she had to pay all that money back. Dear Mrs. Reynolds, pursuant to our conversation on June 10th and your inability to submit your poetry manuscript the other way to Ravensbury Press by the contracted deadline of June 1st, 2010, despite repeated efforts to accommodate you, we regret to inform you that this breach of contract means we shall no longer be publishing the collection as part of our new poet series. As stated in section six of our contract, see attached copy, if the author fails to deliver the manuscript by the agreed date, the publisher has the right to recover the full amount of the 10,000 advance. We have included with this letter a repayment form and schedule. As stated in section 23 of our contract, the rights for your manuscript shall revert back to the author upon full repayment of the advance. If you have any further questions, please refer them to our legal team. We wish you the best, blah, blah, blah. Wow, that's wild, bro. All right, let's see what David on, bro. I definitely gotta say goodbye to him. Yo, Sean. David, hey. what? Karen said you wanted to see me? Oh, yeah, stop. Go grab that police scanner inside first. I gotta put these new plates on the car. Sure. Come on. I never thought. Done. I never have thought, bro, David would be like the one, bro, to help me get away from the cops, dog. Hold on. I definitely wanna look around real quick, though. Must be his ex wife. Yo. He's changed look so at much this. since this. And not for the <laughs> best. Yo. Letter. I feel you, David. Wow, he wrote to Joyce. Dear Joyce, great to get your postcard. You sure get around now. Wish I was, wish I was with you like on our honeymoon. Hope you are seeing the world like you wanted. Oh, I know our lives are so different now. I like to think, but I hope we can. Everything is so different now. And I hope one day we can just have a beer and shoot the shit like before. I miss you. Oh, that's tough, man. That's tough. Okay, how does this thing work? Toggle power. Oh. Uh, okay. Only gotta search between 140 and 160. 140, okay. 136. Oh. Wait, is this it? Is this it? Now we can spy on the cops all the way to Mexico. Thanks, David. W. W. David. Nah, David is tough. I appreciate him for that. That's what's up. And a map? Oh, he's hooking us up. Him and mom. Mom's car is all ready to roll. Did you get the police scanner? Yep. Heck yeah, appreciate I you, dude. I found the police frequency. How about that? Good job. Now, you'll always want to know what they're up to. No surprises on your way to the border. All right. This is the fastest route. When you get there, cross between these two stations. Now. You have to exit the main road and drive through the desert for a while. But Karen's car should be okay. You got all that? <laughs> yeah. Sure. I hope. <laughs> I hope so, dude. I hope so, I don't mess this up. You have to know. The police are on your ass. Y you only get one chance here. I'm not oh. trying to be a dick. Just... Honest. No, I understand. I, feel I know, you. David. I feel you, David. You just Thanks. trying to look out. You just looking out. That's all. Here. Have a seat. Don't mean to order you around. Bad habits die hard. And yes, I was suspicious when Karen showed up with you two. But after watching you and your little brother for a while, I think I get what you're going through. Your experience forms you as a person. And I imagine all the shit you've seen and too much how it's bro. changed you. You do not have any Pretty idea, much. bro. I call not it body. myself. But I had to go through my own hell. In war, 
and at home. I didn't know how to deal with emotions or other people. Your stepdaughter? I'm just, I'm prying. I'm prying a little bit. Talking about your stepdaughter? I got to, bro. Yeah. Some rich fucking kid shot her at school, where I was supposed to protect her. Me and her hated each other on sight. Wow. But once I lost her, everything became clear. How selfish and stupid I'd been. Dang. I should have listened to Chloe. Instead of being a bully, all of my fuck-ups are crystal clear now. But I'm not gonna fuck this up. Uh redemption arc. Hold on, David. Sean, I'm gonna do everything I can to help you get out of here. That's my duty now, but Dude, I want to be straight up with you, okay? I got you. I get it. Yeah. I get it. Of course. I know you guys got screwed, but you think Bad. nobody will ever believe you, but the truth is on your side. You and Daniel can't just hide out forever. Is that how you see yourself? In 10 years? Oh, if you step up and face the law, you can be free. The law don't sooner. I'm not going to lie. The, the law's not nice to people like us. You feel me? Like, I'm just going to keep it a buck, bro. Like, there, it's, it's too. If you know, you know. That's all I'm going to say, bro. If you know, you know. I want a new life, bro. We've come too far now. Yeah. We Which we we in too life. deep. We in too deep now. It's it's too late for That's that. It. It's too late, David. I ain't I gonna understand. lie to you, dude. We I we do. we too deep I'm in, dude. Trying to be the adult. You're too young to be dealing with all this. And Daniel is growing up fast. Too for fast. <laughs> That's what I'm worried about. You I made it here. No childhood, bro. So, I know you're on the right path. Appreciate that, David, for real. That means a lot coming from you, dude. <laughs> oh. Uh, sorry. I really have to take this. Are you good. Appreciate the words, man. Hey, Joyce. Right on time. Oh, you, yeah, do you? I'm gonna let you handle it, David. Go ahead, bro. Go ahead, bro. Handle it, handle it. Yep, yep. <laughs> uh, he over the giddy. Wait. Well, you know lawyers. Who is he talking about, y'all? Much from them. Is he talking about Jefferson? Hey. Oh, need any help? Just checking out the levels and cleaning up the filters. Um. Uh. Wait. So. She's good with cars too, just like the dad. Like it and the he's the good oh, with cars, no. hot wiring it's cars. It runs in the family. It's all genetics. How long have you been driving for? Not long enough. Dad taught me, but I always had other plans. We didn't go cruising too much. <laughs> Esteban was obsessed with his engines. I see why y'all got together. That doesn't mean you had to be too. Um, wanted me to find myself. Yeah. He only wanted me to find my own way. <laughs> Whatever that was. Wish I had more time. Dang. Listen, Esteban loved you and Daniel for exactly who you are. He would be proud. I got no beef with Dad. Dad was cool when he was around. To his homeland today. Uh, wish he was here. Wish he was here with us. It's bullshit that we get to see Puerto Lobos, but he doesn't. I know. But Esteban is still with you. Facts, bro. He always wanted you and Daniel to see where he came from. Yeah. I don't know anything about Mexico. It's scary. Sean, you're carrying the weight of two people on your shoulders now. It's okay to be nervous. I'm just tired of running. I swear, causing bro. Causing trouble everywhere we go. 
Daniel's power <sighs> is overwhelming, and we don't know where it comes from. But you do know your brother. I thought she had powers too, be dog. There for each other. I thought I thought she was the one with powers. That's why Daniel got powers. Uh, I just want this over. I just want to get this shit over with, so we can start over, if we can. Yeah. Your brother sure isn't a little kid anymore. And I, I'm sorry about that. Grow up too fast. <sighs> You're he gonna even have, have a to childhood. learn to trust him, and let go. Even if that scares you sometimes. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. You'll figure it out, like you always do. Okay. Better get back to W words. W All words, right. ma. W words, ma. I'll make one last round before we leaving. Let me say goodbye to um Stanley and Arthur. Hey guys. Say goodbye to y'all real I quick. I came by to say adios. We're taking off today. No, you're not. Uh, I love people like that. Like, oh, do y'all have to go? Like, oh my god, y'all really won't be here. Wish you and Daniel could stay longer. Oh man, um, we gotta cross that border, y'all. We gotta go. The sooner we cross the border, the better. Yeah. No worries. No worries. Bullshit. That's all we're gonna do until you make it. Oh, we will. Thanks to you. And Stanley and Arthur, y'all cool, bro. W you couple. gave us a place to breathe. Sean, I won't drag this out and get bitter. Besides, you and Daniel will be back to visit, right? Yeah. <laughs> no we'll way. <laughs> we, we'll, we'll try, we'll try. US memory. You and your little brother will always have friends here. Appreciate y'all. <laughs> okay. W. I'm done babbling. I just take goodbyes. Man, I know you're both Stanley and Arthur, we, we like this for real. We like this. You better. Uh, we... We're gonna make it work. Shit. I'm gonna miss you guys. Uh, take care. You come on, bring it in. Bring it in, everybody. Me. Bring it in, dude. He needs you. I got Dave. I got Dave. And send Appreciate us a postcard you. to the beach. Love y'all, bro. For real, for real. Y'all real ones. Thank y'all for the hospitality. I appreciate y'all. Dang. That kind of hit crazy. Y'all know I gotta say goodbye to Joanne. Joanne, where you at? Come on. Oh, First snap. Oh, snap. Hey. What's going on? Mm, I'm taking a look at this baby with hindsight. So, what do you think? I mean, it looks cool. Like, looks very cool. We still on this? Y'all not messing with it? I can totally tell what you're doing. <laughs> Good. I don't think Joanne really like it. It's one of us. <laughs> but I like it. Of course, you and Daniel it did inspire me. I love it. Uh, so. You, you were just saying sweet. the other day you weren't yeah, messing with just it. Wanted that's to say crazy. Uh, that's sweet. <laughs> you're so sweet. Your brother is so sweet. Having you boys around. It was the sweetest thing. Oh, Joanne. This is for all your help. Really? Whoa. Oh. That's great. That's uh, cool. Do I get anything? <laughs> Dang. Your name is on a way bigger sculpture. <laughs> yup. For everyone to see. That's true. I didn't think about that. Yeah, there you go. Your brother needed a little something to remind him of the artist inside. <laughs> Wicked. Yo, wicked. Okay, one big hug. Appreciate that, Joanne. Before we all start crying like babies. Yo. <laughs> Thank you. Shoot, I feel it coming. Joanne, for everything. I feel it. Hey, hey. Please take care of yourself. Y'all gonna see some tears and today. My special <laughs> No worries. Oh no. We always do. Hey, is it okay if I hang out a bit longer? <laughs> if it's okay with her. Yeah. Oh, are you kidding? I need more help. So long, Sean. Don't be a stranger. Appreciate you, Joanne. Yo, Joanne, David, Sean. Oh, we got the... Nah, that's tough. That's tough. That's so tough. All right, am I missing anybody? I think that's everybody. All right, y'all. It's time. Daniel, do you copy? It's time to go. It's time to wrap it up. Be right there. Over. So... 
Did you get to say goodbye to a way? Yeah. Kind of sad. I know. Are we leaving yet? We have to. Yeah, we, we, we gone, dude. We gotta go, dude. Mom, I, I'm i gonna miss you. I'll miss you too, Danny. It was amazing to spend this time with you. I'm so damn proud oh, of you both man. and what you're gonna do with your life. And if you ever need me, I'm just around the corner. Okay, Mom. Appreciate Thank that, you. Mom. Appreciate that, yeah. W Mom. Well, Sean, this is it. Oh, uh, oh. Don't hug Karen. What? Karen has done so much for me Thanks, this episode. Mom. Like, last for episode a little bit, I was hesitant about Thanks her, but me, son. I don't, this might be the last time I see my mom, y'all. You feel me? I, I gotta give it the hug. I gotta give her the hug, dude. Shoot. This too much, bro. Y'all gonna make me cry. I gotta take off the glasses, bro. This is about to get. This about to hit crazy, man. David, bro, like, I, I caught David talking to Joyce on the phone. Like, it's a lot going on, dude. Look at everyone. Oh man. She gave us her car, though, y'all. Like. I had Take to care, hug boys. Stuff. Stay safe. Ah, oh, man, bro. This hurts. Bye, everybody. Like you find good people, but we still gotta run, bro. Like, I'm tired of running, y'all. This is crazy. Just let us let, let us cross the border smoothly. No, 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 no problems, man. I don't know if I could do another problem situation. <laughs> nah. Especially if it's gonna separate me and Daniel. It's gonna break my heart, dude. It's gonna break my heart. Hey, is something wrong? We're almost there, okay? That's the last time I have to say that. I don't care about that. So, what's the problem? What? What are we gonna do in Puerto Lobos? We don't oh. know anybody. We're like strangers. How long can we live there? Um, no more running, dude. How do you think we can live here? No more running, and I don't... So, what are we gonna do for money and stuff? I get a job? I get a job, man. It won't be hard. You can probably go to school. Dude, I can't even speak Spanish. Dang. How can I make friends or do anything? If I can't talk. I mean, I'll teach you, dude. I'll teach you, man. You think so? For sure. That's cool. We <laughs> fit in everywhere we go. And we'll get to hang out, too. Um... Well, that sounds okay. I guess. There you go. Reassurance. Anyway, I got you. I get scared, too, you know? But we'll be, we'll be fine. Okay. Facts. I trust you. Thank you. Oh, that's, that's that good bonding, bro. Hey, I've been good to him these past episodes. So he, me and him like this, we tight for real. That's what happens when you got a good bond with your siblings, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? But watch out, bro. Gonna have some tumbleweed in the middle of the street. You're gonna have to be careful, bro. That's the only car we got. And we definitely not gonna be walking no more. I'm sick of walking. Wait, what? 
what? Yo, he driving the car like that? Hey, man. One simple sneeze, we off the road, bro. He better be careful. Hey, man, focus up. Focus up. <laughs> you playing with life right now. This the true definition of ghost riding. Like, dang. Oh, no, nah, bro. We going head first into a damn cactus. That's, that's going to be all bad. The border over here. <gasps> Let's go. That looks so big. We made it, bro. Dude, it's just a giant fence. Except they won't keep us in. All units be advised. After the raid on the way, there was no sign of Sean and Daniel Diaz. We believe they left within the past few hours. The two brothers are still considered armed and dangerous. Proceed with caution. What? Only the mother of the fugitives has been arrested. Dang, mom. Uh -huh. Sean, I know. Why would I know. they arrest mom? I know, why? I know, I know, I know, so I know, Daniel. I know, I know. Come on, let's just but keep it moving, dude. Let's just keep it moving, dude. The cops will have to let her go. I hope so. Why Dang. can't they just leave us alone? They're going to once we're over that fucking wall. Uh, okay, Sean. Yeah, let's finish it, bro. Come on, dude. Let's finish it right here. We here, y'all. Sean, what's up? What's up? What's wrong? Why would they? build this well you know oh it's a border man destroy the wall oh man wait is there like another way we can get i don't know bro it don't look like there's no other way to get in so i might look bro i'm sorry daniel go ahead bro go ahead bro tear this wall open tear it open dude i would not do it this way i'm not gonna lie so <laughs> this is crazy. Are, Daniel. The end of the road. Finally. But if this the only way to get in, Let's hey, get rip that you. wall open, dude. Yeah. Take it easy. You can do it. Look at it. With you, Daniel. This is cinema. This is cinema. Wait, we doing this together, bro. Almost there. What? Wow, Daniel! Uh, what? Almost. It's okay. It's wow, okay. bro. Just breathe. Nah, he went crazy. Shh. Breathe. Oh my goodness. There it is. We did it. We did it. Fuck that shit up. Yo. <laughs> w, bro. Nah, bro. To be honest, yes. you did it, Daniel. You a real one, bro. That's it right there, man. One step. One step over, bro. We there. All thanks to you. It's gonna be all right now. You've done the hardest part. 
Yo. Thanks for taking me down here, Sean. <laughs> nah. We did it together, man. Come on. Let's go back to the car. Yo. Oh, man. Oh, I cannot wait to go swimming in the ocean. Yo, we did it. Dude. That is crazy. I'm dying to get some choco crisp. It'll be so Daniel. Daniel! Daniel, talk to me! Daniel! Talk to me! No. 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 Oh. Oh. No. No way, not now. Daniel! We were so close. No, but we were so close. <sighs> Yo! Oh. oh shit, Madison. I told you it was a fucking kid. Get off what of me! Get off of me! Well, Daniel! Is he? He's my brother! He's okay. Bullet just grazed Let him. Let me go! Do not move if you want to keep that arm. Oh Come my. Comprende? Keep an eye on the wall. These fuckers blew it up so their friends can cross. What? Daniel! Oh, nah. So See, I knew I mean, this was about to be bad, dude. Through, right? No! We're leaving! Going to Mexico, I swear! Wait, wait. You're trying to break into Mexico. <laughs> That's fucking funny. Bro, we're Americans. We're Americans! Americans, damn it! Now, it's not legal to blow up walls. That's called terrorism. You get it? Bro, we're, we're, bro, there's a, bro, we're going to Mexico. Like, we're not even trying to terrorize America, bro. We're literally going to Mexico. You can fucking skateboard across the border 10 miles away. So tell me the plan. What? Wait. Bro, that was not us. It was not us. We have no idea how it happened. It don't. Fuck with us, kid. Oh, You're see, the look, only bro. ones around. See, bro. Looks like no see, one's bro. coming for now. See, bro. Y'all. Anyway, hey, man. don't waste your energy. They the acting like they has they, they covert ops. Like, mistake. what's going on? Madison, come on. Y'all don't even you work for the border patrol. Who are y'all? Still bleeding. Don't touch him. Get off. No fucking way, bro. Are y'all serious? Move. This how I get caught? What? What the fuck? Get it off! Stop! Get it off! Wait, y'all, wait, what? Jesus! What the fuck is going on? What? Where's Spencer? He's off duty today. Why? <laughs> Listen, uh, we have a deal, he knows. Yeah, I heard about this crap. Wait, Not what? happening anymore. Come on, Maddie. Do what the officer says. Fuck! How old is he? He's all right, officer. Don't worry. Shut it! You're both coming with me to the station. What? Are you kidding? What? They're illegals! What? Fuck's sake! What I say? Oh. Uh, okay. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, no. Take a breath. You okay now? Are we cool? Daniel! No. No. What about my brother? No. What about Daniel? No, 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 no. I can't I'm get sorry, separated with him. Sean? Oh, fuck. Sean Diaz? No. Fuck. No, 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 no. <laughs> You're under arrest. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not real. We were that close, y'all. This is, uh, this got bad, bro. Like, I, uh, it's because of those two clowns, bro. Like, those two clowns had to ruin everything. These two, those two, bro. Y'all are so stupid, man. Look at you, especially you, man. Ooh. Lesbian. Oh. 
Sim. Eu sou Diego. Mi, mi esposa Carla e este frijolito de aqui é. Uh, oh, Angela. Oh, Angela. Encantado. Eh, sou Sean. Como te sientes, hijo? Um, Han visto um niño de 10 anos? É uh... mi hermanito. Nos separaron. Oh, man. A, a cerca del muro. Está herido. Lo llevaron a la enfermería. Si fuera grave, una ambulancia ya habría venido a buscarlo. Si lo dejaron aquí, quiere decir que está bien. Tranquilo, amigo. Aquí no hacen daño a los niños. They better not, man. They better not. I'm not gonna lie. I didn't come all the way out here to like. You feel me? Nah. I need to talk to this AO, AO office. Excuse I need my. Me. I need a phone call or something. Do you know where my brother is? One phone call. He's just a kid. Like, dang, dude. He not even. He's sleeping? Hold Hello? up. Wake up, dude. Hello? Ah. Uh, God. That dude is knocked out. Okay. Thank you. Pendejo. <laughs> Saben cuánto tiempo. Nos van a dejar aquí. No. Esta es la primera vez que intentan cruzar. Me acuerdo oh, de nuestra man. primera vez. Casi morimos de sed en el desierto. Uh, we aren't illegal trying to reach Mexico. When was it? Uh, we aren't illegal. No somos ilegales. Nacimos aquí. Intentamos. Yeah, we're trying to go to Mexico. Right, right. México. Right. Ustedes van a ser ilegales en México. Cuestión Ooh, de perspectiva. That's true. Yeah, that's true. That's she got a point. She do have a point. cruzar la frontera. Why? Por qué necesitan cruzar tan desesperadamente? Por las mismas razones que todos. No podemos soportar la inseguridad ni la miseria. En México, la violencia tiene muchas formas. No se puede vivir así. Cuando mi hermano fue Secuestrado wow. y asesinado por una pandilla. It is perspective. Fuimos, They're right. Si They're right. pedido quedarnos, nos habríamos quedado en nuestro pueblo, pero queremos mm. darle una vida, una vida mejor a nuestro hijo yeah. o hija. It's like no way to raise a kid like that. Uh, like, isn't it the, isn't it the easy way? Not El Dorado. What my family did. Es lo que hizo mi papá. Se fue de México cuando murieron sus padres para ganarse la vida. Pero yo sé que extrañaba su pueblo natal. Por supuesto, pero seguro que tuvo sus razones para irse, mm. como nosotros. No quiero desanimarte, amigo, pero lo de México no va a ser fácil para ustedes. Es un país magnífico. Y me cuesta bro. muchísimo dejarlo, pero it, it takes a complete stranger who's from Mexico to like ya no talk some sense Mexico. into us. These two right here, I believe them the most. Toda tu vida con un padre mexicano. Y ahora los tiempos han cambiado. ¿Cómo crees que va a ser todo en el futuro? Um I'm pessimistic. We are integrated. Tuve suerte que mi padre trabajaba duro, que fuimos bien integrados. Lo comprendí cuando murió, cuando me quedé solo. Lo siento mucho, hijo. Cuando eres extranjero, oh. tienes que trabajar aún más duro para arreglártelas. Mm. Así funciona. Oh shit. Enough now. I'm so. It's America. We speak English. It's a miracle. We're just talking. We speak English. No, the like, problem is you people breaking into my country. We come here to work, not, not steal or live at your at your home. Diego, Ooh, no, it, I'm so it's ugly, bro. Tired. You only come here to cause trouble, and we have to pay for your welfare. You all want a free ride, and that makes me sick. Bro. Bro, immigrants built the country. Like, is she stupid? This country. Where did the hold on? Founding fathers come from, huh? No, no, no. That was different. They made 
the laws. They wouldn't stand by and let this happen. We oh, only want work and, and, and then peace. Yes. Hey, man. Uh, honest you can't talk since it's a dummy like our that. Our child in a safe country. That's all we're looking for. Right. These are honest. These are honest people. That's what you people always say. But the facts speak for themselves. What? You're a bigot. Your like, facts are just bigotry and hatred. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I hate what you did to my country. Our borders, we have a right to protect our sovereign nation, and we will. Why Why is dude in the back yeah, not right. saying nothing? You hunt us like, 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 like you I You yes man, bro. You sorry. I don't think I have a yeah, choice. Yeah, just sit back down, bro. Just sit down back there. Children. See? You love your family like us. We don't go walking hundreds of miles in the desert and risking everything for no reason. We do it for our child. A mother must understand. No, you and your unborn parasite have nothing in common with me and my family. Y'all don't think that what? wasn't uncalled Man. for, though? What you say? <laughs> oh, see? There you go. Take it easy. This is our... Hold on, dude. Diego, Siento Diego. Diego. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Calm, 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 calm. Yeah, just relax. This is what she wants, bro. No, this is what she wants. She wants you to act out. Like or not, she wants you to act out, bro. Gonna give you a break. You're in jail too, <laughs> loser. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, Sean. Talk your smack and wake your ass up too, dude. Like, come on, bro. You talking? You, he's still sleeping while we're still arguing. Like, why are we stuck down here bro. with them? You know us. We're helping you, goddammit. Hey, you have the right to remain silent. So fucking use it, okay? <sighs> All right. I bet you she gonna shut up now. I bet you she gonna shut up now, bro. Yeah, yeah. When it, if it's not a if it's not someone who who speaks Spanish, bro, she's definitely going to listen to him. I promise you that, bro. Yes, you're a house. Come on, My bro. Brother. Don't Come worry, y'all. Now turn around, hands behind your back. <sighs> I'ma catch y'all, bro. Y'all be smooth now. Y'all be smooth. Y'all be smooth. Okay. Ooh, I, Let's move it. Ooh, I wanna. Ooh, I wanna spit at y'all, bro. Y'all are y'all are scum. Y'all are what's at the bottom of my feet, bro. Like bottom of my shoe, I should say. You know, I keep my feet clean. But bottom of my shoe, that's what I feel like, bro. Y'all are just the All bottom right. of the barrel. Sit down. Ooh. Where's my brother? He's doing fine for a kid who got grazed by a bullet, lost some blood, but he's tough. They're taking care of him at the infirmary. You want coffee? How you know I love coffee? Okay. How Good. you know I like coffee? Yeah, Be you, right you back. Yeah, it's a number to word. Yeah, let me get. I'll take a cup of Joe. Come on now. They about to interrogate me. Oh, this fuck. is break. What did they do with Daniel? I hope he's all right. I can't break the handcuffs. I'm I'm doing too much, y'all. Like, what would I get from breaking out of these handcuffs? I don't even think I can. And they gonna see me on the camera trying to break out. Oh, Daniel doesn't freak out in here. I'm just gonna chill, y'all. Okay, we cool, we chilling, we chilling. Yeah, I didn't want to break out, bro. They watching me and everything. He gonna think, yeah, he a criminal. Like, I'm, I'm gonna listen to the cops, y'all. There you go. Appreciate that, dude. It looks like you need it. Thanks. All right. Let's see. Hmm. Okay. I hope they'll let me see Danny. Damn. Seriously? He must be scared. Yeah. No. Coffee's gonna make me feel Shit. so much better. Get another sip. Hey, I mean, you feel me? You gonna ask questions or are we just gonna sit here and just look at each other in the eyes? Like, what's, what's going on? Jeez. That's quite a crime spree. Bruh. It's hard to believe what kids can do nowadays. You don't even know the story though. Like you don't know why Killing I did what I did. In Seattle, I didn't kill him. A gas station clerk. Okay, but caught in a, another weird me, explosion. He kept me behind closed doors. California. Pot farm. Then yes, kind of. Join a religious commune in Nevada. I and its leader. See your facts. Your facts are all messed <laughs> up, dude. We're not even halfway down the list. One of those things you could get away with. But not all that. 
Bro, I can explain though. It like your, your crazy, facts are weird, dude. Explain. explain it to Agent Flores. She's on her way now. Come on. She spoke to your mother. Not her. Who took responsibility for the church fire? Um, she says a lot. She says a lot. Who cares? You don't have any proof. Don't drag her into this, okay? She's a good person. Hey, she good peoples. It's not up to me, kid. Listen, I feel sorry for you. I really do. No, but you don't, bro. No, y'all don't. No, y'all don't. Denying what you did will only make things worse. Like, it literally wasn't my fault. It wasn't though. my fault. All I did was try to survive. Yeah, I guess you did. You know, I read the report. You claim that Officer Matthew's death was an accident. So why didn't you wait for the police? Bro, no one would have believed it. I panicked and it was too late. No one would have believed it. Um, uh, if I say I panicked, that sounds kind of weird, though. No one would have believed it. No one would have believed it. No one would have believed what happened. We didn't either. Well... It's too late now. Of your case is, is filled to the brim with evidence. Of course it is. Bro, who, where's is, the evidence, though? Your brother's too young to be prosecuted. He'll end up with your grandparents, if they want him. But you're facing a shitload of years between bars. At least he'll get a life. Uh, what I don't get is... How two kids can destroy so much stuff. I mean, anywhere you went, something blew up. Seriously. How? We're super villains? Random accidents, dude. It happens, Those dude. It's life. We're just random accidents. Yeah, it's crazy, but it just happens around us can't explain it uh-huh listen once is an accident twice uh, is luck ah uh, here we go dude. three times is enemy action whoa uh, what is that is that daniel Sir? wait is daniel uh, about to break us out keep your ass in that seat no i think uh, let me i'm gonna let you know right now don't open Shut. you okay Yo, look at okay. him! Feel. I, I'm okay. Just a little headache. Hold on. Bro, you breaking us. You breaking us out! Dude, we gotta go. Hold up. Is he okay? I I wanted to rescue you, but I I had to use my power. I didn't want to hurt him. He's okay. You good, bro. You good, bro. Yeah. Just, I'm glad you came, bro. I'm glad you came. Let's get out. Let's just do the dash, bro. Let's do the dash. Yo. This dude, Dale. Hey, free them. Can we free them? Can we free them? I really... Who are these people? Oh, man. I want to free them, though, y'all. Carla and Diego. They came all the way from Mexico. They good people, not these two though. God. Keep them in. Thrown in jail for it. Ask Can you break them out? The others. They're the ones who try to shoot you. Yeah. What? Yeah. What up? Yeah. Good. And y'all are going good. to rot. Come on, let's help them. Let's help them. Let's help them. Free them. Free them. Hold Free on. them. Yeah. We're gonna get you out. Yeah. We gonna get y'all out. Don't worry. Daniel. Come on. Yep. There we go. There we go. They not. Oh, Let's go. Y'all though? It's been you two? You Americans? Just... Of course. Can stay in there, bro. Y'all racist as hell too. Yeah. Holy yeah. Mother... Yeah. It don't feel too well that way. Can I do something to y'all? Take revenge? <laughs> oh yeah. Guess what, y'all? I'm feeling a little bit disrespectful. Aren't you supposed to be in a hospital? You look time for payback. It's time, bro. What do you want now? It's time, bro. Turn, Daniel. Go ahead, Let's Daniel. Go. Do what you want, bro. Do what you want to them, bro. Yeah. Yeah. 
Oh yeah, it's about to get real disrespectful. We're better than this, Sean. They can't threaten us in there. You're right. That's you know, yeah. I'm kinda You're right. I'm a little loopy right now. You feel me? I'm I'm a little shaken up. You're right, you're right. Yep, you got better sense than me, Daniel. Let's Ooh, listen. Ooh, y'all y'all motherfuckers so fucking. No, no, y'all so he's okay. Ooh, I swear you so lucky, because if I had the powers, ooh, I would have turned y'all into origami. Listen, it's not even your fault for her, bro. He was already sleeping on the job. You might have just made it permanent. Nah. Okay, oh, shit. Oh, oh. Hey, don't shoot. Hey, Yo, up. chill. Everybody chill. Everybody calm down. Everybody calm Wait, down. Sean. Stay back, Daniel. Hold on, Daniel. Just relax, dude. Just relax, dude. Let me think. Let me figure this out, man. What do I do? Quick. Kill? I gotta find something to stop them. Um... They're dangerous! We will shoot if we need to. What to understand? Wait. Fire Don't do anything stupid! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Do something. Okay, what the fuck? Do not move. This I got her. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. We got to, bro. You're not gonna you're not gonna kill him though. You're not gonna kill him though. Yes. Okay. We you're good. You're good. No, no, no. You're good. You're good. Listen, you're good. We're good. We're good. You didn't kill anybody. You're chilling. They're just, they're just taking a nap, dude. They're just taking a. I think our things are in there. Oh, break it open then. Yeah, break this open. Let's take our stuff. Okay. Cool. Don't move. I'll be right back. Okay, but be quick. I got you, bro. I got you, broski. Okay, we good. We got this. What else we need? Walkie talkie, rifles, vigilante bag. Uh, 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 hold on. What does the vigilante bag have? Bet it belongs to one of these trigger happy people. I think we might, we might need that. Wait, walkie talkies? Hold on. We got walkie talkies. To put so much effort into this. Okay, walkie talkies. We got rifle. I might have to carry this around, y'all. I don't know. You're not gonna hunt shit anymore. Yeah, talk your smack. All right, take this, take this. Yeah, take that. Pretty good memory. From a pretty bad place. Wait, what did I just... Oh, okay, I think I just took a flag pin or something. All right, on, um... Go. No, you're right, you're right. Come on, come on. We good, we good, we good. We gone. We would be so dead if we didn't have Daniel's power. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. We would be cooked. <laughs> we would be cooked. Is that our car? Take it out, Daniel. Come on, Daniel. <laughs> Let's go. Come on, y'all too. Yeah, come on. Okay, go, go. I got y'all, bro. I got y'all, bro. Free y'all, free y'all. Let's roll, Daniel. She pregnant too, y'all. You know what I'm saying? I got, I got to look after them. Hurry, Sean. Drive. Bro, I'm, I just got in the car. Let me put the keys in the ignition. Dang. We still running, bruh. Like, that was intense now. That was that was crazy intense, y'all. Holy, holy. Oh my goodness. No, nobody is chasing us. Nobody was messed up, bro. Not yet. We tore that whole place up, dog. I mean you did, not me. You feel me? This is all points bulletin for every unit in the area. Multiple oh. prisoners, two adults, and two teenagers have escaped from the L Ray police station. They are considered armed and dangerous. Repeat. Oh, man. Are we still going <sighs> to Mexico? Yeah. We got nowhere else to go. This is... This is crazy, bruh. Sean, it's the 4th of July, our first one without dad. Oh, you're right. Remember how he was so in the fireworks every year? He always made us go too early. So Dang, look at the handcuff still on me, too. <laughs> I know. Oh, I, that looks crazy. He was so corny. 
He said he was proud to live in this country. Okay, we're back. Had a slight detour, but we're back now. Back. Jeez. Shit. This. Sean, what are we Sh gonna do? Sean? Sean. Sean? Sean Diaz. Sean? Hey, bro. Don't make this worse. Agent Flores, you motherfucker. Ooh. Sean, what we gonna do? Oh, man. Oh, man. You know that day? In Seattle, the date Dad was shot. I think about it every day, and I would give anything to change what happened, but I can't. I'm sorry for my mistakes. I tried my best. I swear, Sean. Oh, bro, like, so it's the end of the road, that. bro. Like, Just like Dad would be. We both learned a lot together. But you can make your own rules now. If we surrender, they will separate us, Daniel. And if that happens, promise me that you will always do the right thing, okay? Don't waste your power. Be smart. Like you already are. I don't want to be separated. Whatever happens, <sighs> always remember that you're Daniel Diaz. I promise, Sean. So, how does the story of the Wolf Brothers end? Fuck, man. Can't keep doing it, bro. Hi. I think the story bro. ends right here. I tried, here? Bro. I can't, bro. But I, I could. No, bro. No, bro. No, bro. No, bro. I get it. It's, it's not worth it, dude. It's not who we are. It's not worth it. Exactly. We're not criminals. We're just kids. And you we are just a kid, dude. You just, you still a kid, what bro. life we want to live. You're my brother. And I love you. I, I love you too, Sean. It's gonna be all right. I promise. Promise for real this time. I do. We're doing the right thing. Just try and remember what I taught you. I mean, only the good shit. <laughs> I will. Oh, I swear.
love you, dude. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. On your knees. I said on your knees now. It's cool, Daniel. It's cool, bro. It's cool. I'm sorry oh, no. about all this. Oh, you not, bro? The fuck off of me! Stop touching me, one. dude! And y'all better make sure he's good. Y'all better make sure he is good, bro. Okay, he's ready. Sean! No, Sean! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. He's gonna be fine. Daniel, you're not a little wolf anymore. Never oh, forget man. who you are. Never. Fight, bro. You gotta fight on, bro. <laughs> Even if it's without me, you gotta keep going, dude. <laughs> oh my goodness, though. <sighs> what the? Oh, that just killed me. Thank you. Thank you, Claire and Steven, bro. He's okay. With them, he's going to be okay. Yes, bro. A scholar, bro? Like, what? Oh, my goodness. Oh. He's working. Fifteen years after the events at the border. Oh. Wait, Mom? Daniel? Get you. You grow so much, bro. Like, bro, like, like. Oh, Sean. Oh, Sean. <laughs> you didn't give up that shirt, bro. Like, <laughs> oh my goodness. I knew it, bro. I knew I was gonna find him again, bro. I found you once. I'm, I'm gonna find you again, bro. 
no matter where you are in the world, bro, I'm going to always find you. Wow. 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 Oh, y'all, this. I wasn't ready, man. I was not ready for it. I knew it was coming, but I, ooh, it, it all just hit me at once. <laughs> it all hit me at once, bro. I think this is my good ending, bro. This right here is... Oh. Yo! Look at us. This gotta be the good ending, man. Oh, man. Oh, it's our old spot. Oh, my goodness. This is when we first win. <laughs> Yo. Still same old Daniel, man. Oh, Sean. Sniffing in y'all's ear, bro. <laughs> my fault, my fault. I'm so sorry. But hey, it's hitting crazy. I don't want to see y'all. I got snot running down my like. <laughs> oh boy. Wait, is that the car that dad gave us? Oh, wait. Yo. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh my God, bro. Oh, he clean with it. Oh my goodness. <sighs> at least, at least day was okay, bro. That's what matters to me the most, bro. Like, that's me IRL though. Like, I don't care what happens to me. As long as my brother's good, bro. As soon as my brother was born, I knew I had a second year. Like, I had a second chance of living, bro. Like, before him, I was so depressed, y'all. Me and my brother are 10 years apart. And I was like, I don't know. Like, I just... Oh, man. He came at the right time. That's all I gotta say. Wow. What an episode, bro. What an episode. That episode right there is probably hit the most for me. Like, me personally, it really, I, I, I kind of resonated a little bit more than the other Life is Strange endings that we've played. The other Life is Strange endings were sad in their own respective way. But I feel like this game entirety from episode one to episode five, like, it was just hitting in every right direction, bro. Like,
especially when it comes like the entire the entire time I was thinking about my brother the entire time and all the choices I made were choices that if it came down to it where my brother and I were in this situation I hope we're never <laughs> but if it came down to it how far would you go for the ones you love like that right there is something I cherish so much about this game how much it just hit hit me crazy bro my older siblings out there y'all understand bro you decided to surrender the police and daniel accepted 31 percent, 33 percent. you decided to force the roadblock and daniel accepted wow overall you taught daniel to do his best to follow the rules of society 60 percent. overall you taught daniel to put himself and his brother first wow Oh, snap. Oh, thank you. You did the treasure hunt and found the hidden souvenir, 90%. You overall got closer to Karen, 81%. You wrote a caring note to Karen, 68%. You said farewell to Arthur and Stanley. Had to. I love those two right there. You said farewell to Joanne, 70%. You hugged Karen before leaving, 93%. You intervened to calm Diego in the cells, 75%. You freed the Mexican couple, 67%. Oh, I love the 67% of y'all, bro. You asked Daniel to open the vigilante cell 16%. You didn't ask Daniel to free the vigilantes 84%. Hey, that's why y'all are cool, bro. I, I love y'all, bro. That Y'all y'all smart for that. You asked Daniel to take revenge on the vigilantes 20%. <laughs> I had to, bro. I had to. You didn't ask Daniel to kill the officers to escape the police station 82%. Yeah, I just wanted him to knock him out for real. Daniel was towed off about the scorpion and stopped messing with it 44%. Daniel managed to set up Joanne's sculpture with your help, 81%. Daniel was concerned about hurting Officer Campbell, 60%. Daniel wasn't asked to free the vigilantes, 84%. Yes, sir. Daniel refused to take revenge on the vigilantes, 6%. Yeah, the vigilantes, y'all are lucky, bro. Y'all are lucky, because y'all lucky he a, not, he a good kid, bro. Me, on the other hand, pfft. Hey, if I had the powers, like I said, y'all would have been origami, bro. Daniel knocked out the officers, 38%. Daniel wasn't asked to kill the officers, 82%. Thanks for playing and following Sean and Daniel on their journey. Oh, will they return? Will Sean and Daniel ever return, y'all? Oh my goodness. And look at them, bro. The family's there. The dad, Sean, Daniel. Oh my goodness. What a way to end this off, man. If y'all did enjoy the entire series, bro, Please do like, share, and subscribe. I highly appreciate every single one of y'all that was with me along this journey. A lot of ups and downs, a lot of tears, a lot of laughs. But we came to the conclusion of Sean and Daniel's story. I feel like it was kind of a good ending. I mean, not so much for Sean, but Daniel, he turned out to be a good kid. He turned out to be someone who is accepted in society and... You know, he went to school, he graduated and got a job. Like, it just sucks for Sean, man. Sean went through so, so much. Carrying so much weight on his shoulders, raising Daniel, and trying to take care of himself too at the same time, bro. Because let's not forget, he, he is a teenager. He was a teenager at the, at the time. You know, dude was still in high school. In terms of the Life is Strange that we've played, I will say this game right here is just... I'm going to put it up there as number one for me, y'all. Number one, because like I said, as an older brother, it just hits crazy. And how far would you go for your younger brother, your younger sibling, wh whoever, bro? Like, how far would you really go for them? And I feel like this right here is a, a good self-reflect on myself and on what I would do in a situation if push comes to shove like this. I hope we're never, ever in a situation. Ryan, if you are watching this, I know you watch my videos. Let's never in our life get in a situation like this, okay? I think we're doing pretty good in life right now. I know like we might have our differences as siblings and we might get into it with our siblings, but at the end of the day, when our parents are gone, I feel like we're all we got, you know? So whether you're you moved out and you're away from your sibling, make sure you send them a call, text, you know, like how I do it with my brother. I don't live with my brother anymore. Uh, it's been like three years now and how I communicate with my brother and how we, we know we, we stick close to each other. Um, I'll call him here and there. I'll text him. Usually like we're not really much of like on the phone type of people. We'll text, we'll send each other some stuff on like TikTok or something just to just to remind each other that we're still thinking of each other. You know, we're never it's never a day where we're not thinking about each other. So 
that's what I like, you know, you know what I'm saying? That's what I like about this game. This game really reminded me of how much a sibling bond is, like how much it, how far it goes, you know, and how much we need to just appreciate each other more, especially as people. Like, I feel like we need to be much nicer to people in this world and like just spread love and positivity. You feel me? Like a lot of people, this this is a crazy world, bro. This world is a is full of evil and just bad people bro and i kind of just want to be the difference i want to be the difference of being a nice person i might not be able to change the world but if i could at least spark a couple brains bro to like be a better person day in and day out hey man i feel like I've, i'm doing my job and that's why i like making these videos because i like to spread the joy positive energy and just good vibes all around and i hope y'all are feeling that too when y'all are watching these videos so i appreciate y'all watching every single life is strange video bro like like I said, without y'all, none of this would even be possible. Make sure y'all join up on the Discord for the latest notifications or any updates I have on production of these videos, bro. Sometimes I'll let y'all know if I'm done editing or like what time I'm, I'm gonna post it and everything like that. So make sure y'all join up on the Discord. Anyways, y'all, stay cheerful, stay motivated, and stay blessed. I'm gonna catch y'all in the next one.